Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here, another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to fix a corrupted USB or hard disk drive on your device. So this is going to be a pretty straightforward tutorial and we're going to just jump right into it. So basically we're going to just be reformatting and partitioning a drive. And it should hopefully fix your problem. Um, please keep in mind any information that's probably stored on your device will not be there. Um, the, this tutorial is not guaranteeing that we're going to be able to recover any data because once data is corrupted and lost, I mean, there's very little one can do about it. So in this brief tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to ease the pain a little bit and make it a little bit better. So in order to clear it and hopefully fix it for future use, what you would do is right click on the start button and then left click on the command prompt admin from this menu. So select that. If you get a user account control window, you want to select yes to that. So now in the elevated command line window, you want to type disk part, one word, and then you want to hit enter. So this will launch the Microsoft Disk Partitioning Utility. So just be patient here, it will take a moment. So once you have the disk part field appears right here, you want to insert list and then space disk. And then you want to hit enter on your keyboard. There should be two different disks listed here. Typically, the smaller of the two would be your flash drive or USB, the larger would be a hard drive. You might have multiple partitions set up on your hard drive, so you just want to know which one is which. You can always check by the size of it, that's always a good indicator of which is which. So I actually do not want to clear my disk one here, but let's just say we did, because I actually do have stuff on it, but let's say I wanted to clear it, we would type select disk one, then you hit enter. It would say this one is now the selected disk, and you would type clean, and then you would hit enter again, and then after you're done that, you would type create partition primary, and then again you would hit enter, and then once that was done running, you would type exit to close out of the command line window. And then if you want to do an alternative way, you can close out of the command line window. Head over to File Explorer. You can type it in on the Start menu or whatnot. We want to get to the screen where it shows all the drives that we have on our computer. So I'm going to go underneath this PC and it tells us our drives here. You could just simply right click on the drive and then left click on Format. You would want to make sure that the file system type is set to the NTFS file system. So that should be the default and that should be how you're going to set it. Allocation size, make it sure it's just the default one, regular size. And after that, you would left click on start and then you would clear that. So if I clicked on start here, please keep in mind formatting will erase all data on this disk. Click on OK. This will take a couple minutes here depending on how big it is, and then it should say formatting complete, and then you should be able to access that drive once again. So I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out, and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.